She slid the ring off his finger. I'll find the bastards who did this. I'll find them, and I'll kill them. For Nate, for Sean, for Stella. Hello universe, I'm here. It's Josh Wasabi, and it's time to play The Tragedy of Stella Rose in Fallout 4. Welcome back folks, at the end of last episode. Pushing, pushing farther, kept pushing and pushing, and I found Virgil's freaking laboratory in the Rocky Cave. I just kept going. I was like, I don't know. We just keep going. I was terrified that I was going to be in the wrong direction because I didn't know where this... I've never played this before. I have no idea where this thing was. So I was worried as a player that I was going to get her rose stuck somewhere out here in the middle of this death place with no real protection. Um, and I don't know how the mechanics of res and your health work. I know it decreases it. I don't know how far it can decrease. I imagine it can kill you. I don't know. I didn't want to get stuck out here with a quick save that just ruined it. Um, where I'd have to like cheat by fast traveling or something like that. But anyway, we found it said Virgil's laboratory and I got super excited at the last one. I'm recording this immediately after that one just because I really want to know what happens next. Um, but for Rose's sake, we don't know what this place is. We just found this cave and you know, we're way out here. We're being chased by monsters and giant scorpions and like, scorpion fly, dragonfly, stinger things. Um, so we're like just running and trying to find this guy and ran into this cave and then we're gonna we're gonna play it from there as if we just came in the cave we're gonna stay as rose um we're not gonna roll yet like we normally do at the beginning of every episode we're not gonna roll yet we're gonna roll um after we get in here and i'm i mean as a player and because of the names i know this is virgil's laboratory we're gonna find virgil or something related to virgil and after we sort of get some closure with that thing then we'll do some rolling and we'll figure out what we do next uh, but we're going to finish this up uh, just because I don't want it to decide that Rose is going to go do something else. We've made it all this way. That was kind of the point of the rolling system. But this is this is too much. That's asking too much. So we're going to we're going to finish this one up here um, and see what happens. So here we go. All right. We are crouched, I believe. Um, and there's these can things and some light. This could be those crazy... Um, people back there, right, dog? Uh, so we just came inside. That little piece of metal sticking out right there on the right looks like a safety hazard for the person living here. Like, just forget about that one day coming in with groceries or some shit and trip and rip your leg off. Oh, God. Well, the, whoever's here knows we're here. Hi, I'm looking for Virgil. Hi. Oh, shit. They're not shooting. Is that a good... Hello? They're not shooting at us, dog. I mean, is they're friendly here? Should I put this away? Ah. Hello? Rattle, rattle. Hello? Oh, it's an automaton. Hold it. Whoa. Take it nice and slow. Uh-huh. No sudden moves. Oh, you're one of those. I know you're from the Institute. So where's Kellogg? Huh? Trying to sneak up on me while you distract me? It's not going to work. I'm not stupid. I knew they'd send him after me. Uh, Kellogg's dead, yo. I, I killed him. He's he's dead. We, we, we murdered him. Uh, Yeah, I don't want to piss him off right now. I mean, yeah. Take it easy. Kellogg's dead. Dead. He's dead. Don't you lie to me. No, no lie. I, I, I bashed his skull in. I, I used this bat right here in my hand. I'm not lying. I killed him myself. Did you? Kellogg was ruthless. There's a reason the Institute used him to do their dirty work for so many years. I knew they'd send him after me. Tried to prepare for it. But I still wasn't sure I'd make it. And so you... You killed him, eh? Then what do you want with me? Okay. So, I'm assuming that's a different colored thing there. That that's going to continue us on with the quest. Oh, it's, it's all... Um... Um... Um, Whoa. Mr. Protectron, I'm sorry. Uh, we're just gonna, like I said, we're gonna get this done with, so let's talk to him. 
Why did you leave the Institute? I know you came from there. You know about the escape? But how? What was that thing? No. It doesn't matter. I'm not going back. I can't go back. Look at me! Why are you even here? What do you want? Well, I can't really see. You're in the dark, though. Okay, I need to get in there. Quit your whining. I just need to know how to get inside. Relax. I just need to know how to get in there. Okay, we're gonna 1D4 this because we're supposed to be playing as Rose. I wanted to. I thought that was quest related, but I guess that was perk related. I don't know. Anyway, uh. Hey, I'm talking to you. Yeah, and I'm listening. Oh! My, uh, the, the dice recording just crapped out on me. Hang on one second. Okay, sorry about that, everybody. I'm gonna put that back on pause, uh, so I don't lose his dialogue. Um, I don't know what happened, but the recording for the iPhone screen crapped out on me. I had to get it restarted. Uh, anyway, uh, we're gonna roll a 1d4 to find out what dialogue choice we're gonna choose, because they all say the same thing. Ultimately, just we'll let Rose be random. Three! Quit your whining. <laughs> Quit your whining. I just need to know how to get inside. It's not whining if... Wait, what? You want to get into the Institute? Are you insane? Never mind how nearly impossible that is. Even if you were to succeed, it'd almost certainly end in your immediate death. What reason could you possibly have for taking that kind of risk? Whoa, what's that? Why so okay, this is not quest stuff. Um She might say that though. Let's 1D for it again. Four. There it is. I'm trying to find my son. The Institute kidnapped him. Oh. Oh no. I had no idea. I'm sorry. Yeah. The Institute has taken people from the Commonwealth in the past. If your son is one of them, I can understand why you'd want to get in there. I can help, but I'm going to need something in return. Huh. Um. So honestly, I don't feel like this is a secondary quest thing. Like, we're not coming back out here. We're going to take this quest. Um, so we're going to do... We're gonna find out what he wants. What do you want from me? Before I had to escape, I was working on a serum that would serve as a cure for my... condition. I wasn't able to bring it with me. It's still in my lab and... well... look at me. I need it. I need you to find it for me if you manage to get inside the Institute. What do you say? Look at you. I'm trying to turn on my spot. I can't. All right, fine. I'll pick up your thing for you. You help me, and I'll help you. All right. All right. Let's talk details. First things oh. first. You know how synths get in and out of the Institute? You're a super mutant. He's wearing glasses? Okay. So he's just... He's not some blind, murderous bastard. That's interesting. Yeah, they use some sort of teleporter? Well, well. Not many know about it. Pretty closely guarded secret. You've certainly done your homework. It's commonly referred to as the molecular relay. I don't understand all the science behind it, but it works. Dematerializes you in one place, rematerializes you in another. I'm sure it sounds crazy, but it's a reality. The Relay is the only way in and out of the Institute. You understand? The only one. That yep. means you're going to have to use it. Now, have you ever seen an Institute courser? <sighs> sure, lots of them. No, never heard of them. I can literally say these things. Uh, I don't really know. It doesn't sound familiar. Actually, 1d4, I don't know. One! A courser? What's that? Another Institute secret. Coursers are Institute synths, designed for one purpose. They're hunters. Operations go wrong, a synth goes missing, and a courser is dispatched. They're very good at what they do, and you're going to have to kill one. Okay!
All right. So let's let's do it. I, Rose doesn't give a shit. Like, you realize what I've been through to get to you? Fuck. I gotta kill one institute hey, crony? I'm... Let's go. Just point me in the right direction. Well, I suppose your enthusiasm counts for something. Every courser has special hardware that gives them a direct connection to the relay in the institute. It's embedded in a chip in their heads. You need that chip. But to get it, You'll have to find a courser. Now I don't know exactly where you can find one. They haven't sent any after me. And sitting here waiting doesn't seem like a good plan. You're going to have to hunt one down. I can tell you where to start and give you some help finding one. But you'll have to do the dirty work. Oh god, so we gonna have to go do a thing for him and then come back to him? Jesus. Uh, 1d4. 3! I don't see why you can't do this. Back in the Institute is the last place I want to be. Now listen up. The primary insertion point for coursers is in the ruins of CIT, directly above the Institute. So you'll want to head there. Now, the relay causes some pretty heavy interference all across the EM spectrum. You've got a radio on that Pip-Boy, right? When you get to the ruins, tune it to the lower end of the band and listen in. You'll be able to hear the interference. Follow the signal, and it'll lead you to a courser. Then, you just have to... not get killed. Not gonna lie. The odds aren't in your favor here. But if you do make it, Remember what I said about the serum. I need it badly. I... I really do hope you find what you're looking for. Oh, thank you, Virgil. Um, okay. So... We just learned... Is that... Is it? Let's see where the marker is pointing. The CIT ruins. I've actually found them already. Sweet! So, what we're gonna do... Something, like I said, out of the ordinary like I did last time is fast travel because I'm not walking back through this. That was, that's freaking horrifyingly horrible. Um, so we're just gonna fast travel to there if, of course, that is the thing we, we, we pick. So, uh, that was a, uh, like, ten minute intro, uh, into what's gonna sort of be the start of the video because, oh, we gotta level up too, ha ha! Um... We're gonna we're gonna roll uh, for stuff and we'll do level it up and quest choosing and all that stuff. Uh, Cause Rose got us here. Rose got us here and rushed in here and talked to Virgil um, and figured out that Sean's not here. This guy doesn't have a magic button that'll shoot us into the institute, but we've gotta go find this special person or machine or something. Uh, connected with the Institute and take their stuff in order to, to bring it back here so then he can help us so shit I mean, it's a whole lot more crap they got to do Rose is a little burnt out on that um, Maybe maybe not uh, the roles will decide that so here. We are we are going to the initial Rationality role and uh, we are level 13. So our one Well shit. Yeah 1d 20 1d 10 1d 3 15, eh, just a little too high. Uh, so Rose is going to be making decisions. Alrighty. Well, um, then we're just going to include that in everything. Rose is going to make this decision. 1d8. A 4. Charisma. She wants to be able to talk to people better, I guess. Um, and it is... It's at 5, so we're still rolling a 1d8. It's a 2. 1, 2. Oh, hello. That's actually a really good perk. Way to go. <laughs> That's a helpful perk, given that she's female. Although, I don't know if it would be available. It would be the other perk if it... I don't, yeah, I don't know much about this. Anyway. Uh, boom. There's that. Okay. Cool. Now, uh, we have to decide on quest stuff. So, we have... One. Two. Nope. Three. Nope. Four. Nope. Five, six, seven, 
eight. We have eight. Just like the last video. Okay. One, two, ten, go. Five. Oh, we're not doing the main quest. One, two, three. No. One, two, three, four. Find the pipe revolver in Monsignor Plaza. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> Shit. Rose is overwhelmed and done with this shit. She's like, screw it, I'm gonna do some random crap for some random dude. Alright, but she's got enough sense in her head to know that we gotta get out of here with this damn suit. We're gonna fast travel for wheels, but... Whoa. Why? Thank you. <laughs> I was just trying to turn off the thing. Okay. Um, do you have... Oh god. Dog? Really? Really? Oh god. Oh god, I shouldn't be down here. Um... Do you have a power armor station? You do not. Okay. Well, can't repair here. Alrighty then. Serve. Uh, all right, then we're gonna fast travel. We're not gonna go directly necessarily to wherever this person is. Oh, we can't even do it there anyway. Huh. Interesting. Oh, we can. We could go directly there. Well, so here's what I'm gonna do. We're not gonna fast travel uh, just from wherever we are to where we need to go. We can fast travel from Virgil's place to Diamond City. And then we have to get everywhere on foot. Just It's just not roleplay friendly to do it any other way. I don't really like this. It could almost come out here and make Edge of the Glowing Sea and make our way um, over that way. But the problem for me is that the power armor is going to freaking die real soon. And I don't even know how to find cores. And yeah, yeah, yeah. So I hope that's not too much of a roleplay kill for anybody. Let me know if it is, and we can change the way we do this, but uh, for now, what we're going to do, we can fast travel between Diamond City. Um, yes. Yes. Maybe not. Do I have to step outside to make it work? Maybe. Uh, we can do that. So, just between Virgil's Laboratory and... Diamond City. Those are the only two things we're going to fast travel between. Um, ugh, oh, God, this place. I hate this place so much. So much! Yes. Okay, cool. <laughs> Just had to step outside. That makes sense. It's a pretty standard Bethesda type thing to do. Let's make us be outside. They try to put limitations on it. Piper? Jesus Christ. Um, and I am actually just going to leave it here. Um, yeah, no, 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 we're gonna put it down. We're gonna play this. Let's play the game. Play the game, Josh. Whoa. All right. We survived the glowing sea. What up, fools? And if any case anybody was wondering, um, the difficulty is on freaking hard. Not, not on easy or any shit like that. We, we fucking survived the glowing sea and found that fool. First try, fools. Hours, your best I'm so glad I didn't give up. <laughs> Five minutes from here. Most sense scared the hell out of me, but Nikki, he ain't like those insects. If you wanted to make me a second printing press while you're at it. Well, that doesn't need to be. My legs are broken. This one's got none. Repair. It. Let me equip it. We need to find an arm. We're gonna repair this thing. Here we go. Fully repaired. Yay. Okay. Alright, and then we're gonna leave it. We're gonna leave it here. Um, nobody seemed to take it last time. Uh, I don't know. We're gonna assume like there's a... I don't know. Some way to leave it and it'd be fine. Now we have to go... Rose has decided she's gonna do this random thing over here. Oh, it's just to our northeast, mostly north, north northeast. Oh God, how do I get out of this place? There's You're getting pretty the... chummy with that report, huh? No, stop yeah. talking about me. Nobody cares what you think. Yeah, run around in power armor would be a wonderful thing. Rose would love the shit out of that, but there's not enough juice, and it'll still move when you're out of the power, the the battery things. But, but then it's you know super stupid slow, and that's not a good idea. So, anyway, we're gonna go north-east. North-northeast. 
Let's do it. Turn the freaking light on, because it's still dark outside. We did all this in the dark. I don't think time passed when I fast traveled. That's kind of dumb. Maybe we should have taken a nap. But Rose is just ready to get moving. I'm wary of that place. I think I've run into trouble in there multiple times. Haven't we, dog meat? Yeah, there you go, starting shit. Stop starting shit, man. We don't have a reason to fight everything. Like, that's, that's not what we're doing here, man. We're just trying to get on with our lives. Speaking of which, I probably shouldn't just be walking around with this bat out. I mean, just people probably think it's pretty antagonistic. I need to just follow this follow this road. I need to follow this road all the way up. And uh, I, I think it has a bridge we can cross. Uh, well, this is awkward. Um, okay, don't run out. Don't Where did we go? Look at that pit boy thing. Oh, we're one block too far east. Or west. I need to go east. Okay, here we go. Alrighty. I don't see the telltale signs of bandit bastards or super mutants. Um, you know, so barricades and body bags. Literal, literal bags full of bodies. Oh, shit. That's a hole. Guess we need to look down a little bit. I think we've been across this before. Have we fallen in that hole before? It's entirely possible. Okay. We have come across this, though. Oh, shit. Another hole. Oh, God. Across to that thing. Across to this thing. Oh, shit. Get out of the water! Ah! Gross. Okay. We came across here. And then... It is almost directly northeast. I zoom in, look at the streets. Um, should I stay along the coast? I thought that might be safer. And then second sort of bridge, then turn left. I think I might try that. Let's try to stay along the, um, not coast, but... Is that a safe way? I have no idea. I have no idea. Dog, protect me. I don't want to actually be in the water. Piper, what the hell are you doing? Oh, this woman just keeps following me. Everywhere I go. Why? Piper. Stop. Hey, point the way. Hold position. Following me. Not going anywhere. Stop following me. You can stay out here and die for all I care. God damn it. Ugh. Some people just can't take a hint. Okay, so this is the first one. Now leasing. Hey, you go get it. Oh shit, this is a sign of signs of bandits. Oh, fudge, 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 fudge. Okay, I don't know where I am. GPS, help me. Um, oh, I'm fine. Take this road to the next major intersection. God, damn, I would be so lost. Out of character here, I would be so lost in a in a city apparently without GPS or a map. I mean, if there was a mod to, like, remove the little character placement on... Oh, God, oh, that was Slenderman up there. <laughs> Freaky. Uh, to remove that off of the Pip-Boy map, I, I think I might be incapable of doing this. Hey, I did the right thing. Okay. So it's up here on the corner, and I'm trying to retrieve a pipe revolver. How the hell am I doing this again? What? Hi, are you a bad guy? You seem really confused. Hello? Hello? Ah! God damn it. Ah! Oh, really? You're gonna use your arm? Ah! Ah! Oh god. What is that? Light? Where the fuck is that light coming from? Is it that right there? I think it is. Is that following me? Ah, I got an idea. Check out. Good bastard. Alrighty, I'll take your fusion cell. Your fucking switchblade. It's a pretty sweet 
freaking helmet you got, though. I think I, might, I think I might have to put that shit on my face. Let's see. I think I might have to put that shit on my face. Yeah, that's pretty freaking sweet. <gasps> yeah. We're gonna put that shit on. What? We're, that We have a baseball cap. And that's all we have to take off. Now we're gonna do something weird here. And... Oh god, this. Nice. Haha! <laughs> yes. Very scary. I don't remember how to play this game apparently. Please? Please? I don't. Okay. Oh my god! Ah! Okay. Um, is it this thing? I don't want that out. There we go. Is it this thing? Wait. I think I had energy cells? Is that gonna shoot at me? It's not shooting at my dog. Wait. Huh? Is this? What the hell is going on? Are they confused because Who's I'm wearing there? the mask? The ma the helmet? I'm confused because I'm. What the? Nothing there now. What do you think? I don't understand. This is the building, right? Don't you hate that when you're like. Zooming in on GPS, is this the place I'm looking for? And you just can't figure out what the hell. That doesn't help. Nuka Cherry. Yes? What? What? Where? What? Oh. Richard's note. I don't care. Pipe, pipe pistol, right? Damn it. Sunglasses would be cool. I can't wear them with this, though. What, dog? Ammo is good. You want a- you want a bugle? Okay, I took all the things. What the hell? Yeah, this- this dude died. He's got a freaking note on him. Wait, maybe it leaves the treasure. Uh Uh This It says what makes you think people will buy copies of the newspaper from you when they could just get one in Diamond City? Okay, maybe some of the traders. Um okay, I don't know why I have this. I don't know why I have this either. Apparently, I cannot drop this. Whatever! Keep your stupid thing. No! Oh. Alright, whatever. Anyway. Dog, stop being weird. I heard, like, bandit people over here. Maybe that's what this is. A bandit compound? I have to go... Am I rescuing it for somebody? Jeez. See, she wrote down what she needed to go do. But she didn't write down... She being Rose. She didn't write down... Why? Or specifics. Oh, I think we're going inside now. Are we? Okay. Are we? Shit. Where the f- Oh, it's freaking behind me. It, the, it's this building over here. Okay, 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 okay. But- did I not get over here to the front of this? What the? F okay, hold on. I need to see this again. What am I doing? Find the pipe revolver revolver in Monsignor Plaza. Monsignor Plaza. Ooh, Who stores their ammo in the trash can? I don't know, but you just lost out, fool. Is this Monsignor Pl Oh, wait. Plaza. The, the plaza? Is this the plaza? The, the plaza is marked as a building. And it's further up this way. Okay, from where I was. It's not right there. It's up here.
So, here. Hey! That's what we need. Okay. Let's go in all ghosty like. Sneaky, sneak, sneak. Let's go sneaky crack some heads. Hello? There's a police robot and a half of a body in the basketball goal. That's just morbid. Is my light on? Oh, it is. Well, that probably wasn't helpful. Was the, was the entrance glowing? I don't know. I don't see anything there. Um, I hear footsteps, though. I totally hear footsteps, doggy. We can't see. Let's. How much? Oh fuck! Why? Oh no, it's not that. It's it's. Shh. Oh, it's not helpful. Okay, just stand up. God damn it! <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I can't freaking see anything when I do that. Um. Shit! What? Well, and I totally forgot what I was looking in here for. Is that radiation? That's the radiation meter. Ah, oh, yeah. Okay. Um, what the fuck did I come in here for? Oh, weapon. Do I have any ammo for this? 13 cells? Is that 13 shots? I feel like that's not 13 shots. Hey, when I beg, it's just you or me. Nothing personal. God, I hope the next one dies clean. Oh, great. Huh? Hearing shit. Yeah, you are. Huh? What the hell is that? I must have a concussion. I'm fucking seeing things. Gun brace. I don't know what I just did. Looks like a trap. Oh, it's like rigged to this fridge. Which doesn't have anything in it. What? Well, this does, though. Frickin' heads and what stuff. The What the what? Dog, go kill some people. Oh, getting looking. shook up over nothing. Yeah, stop getting shook up. I'm all shook up. Banana. Uh, dude. Okay, we're looking for a pipe pistol. Yes. Shit, I can't fucking remember. Why well, can't I remember simple shit like this? Pipe revolver. Pipe revolver. Hey. Do I have one of those? Wait, can I activate this? Ooh. Oh, can we turn this on here to go kick some butt? <gasps> oh, dorky. All right, rationality roll. See who gets to do this. I'd rather Rose do it though. Uh, we are level 14, so 1d20, 1d10, 1d4. Okay, way out of bounds. Okay, so there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay. So, 1d20, and if it's above 15, then we we walk away. 1d20. Number one. Is it this? Shit, it's not. Okay, and go. 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, shit. Nope, this. Nope. Um, 11. 5. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. It is not, uh, nine. Eleven, ten, nine. Is it this? Damn it. Ah. Uh, we got locked out. Well, fail. Everything's starting to sound like footsteps these days. Yeah, well, I was about to have some police footsteps on your face, but, uh. Oh? Where are you? I hear you, and you keep talking a whole, whole lot. This is like a little mall thing. Get a grip on yourself. See, if if we could, if Rose remembered, oh yes, let's take it. if Rose remembered why we were here, like she could possibly remember, you know, is it going to be randomly found in here somewhere? Did they stash it in a particular place? Is it held by these people who keep hearing me? Um, like are these bandits who took it? The Unstoppables. Oh, man. Yeah. You don't have any of those around here? Just, you know... Sean? Shane? Sean? Shane? Shane? Sean? Oh, God! I can't remember my kid's name. Sean probably loved that. 
Give him a burnt te textbook. Got a visor? <laughs> I always wanted to be an accountant. And you picked the wrong fight. Oh shit. Okay. Well, that wasn't quite what I was trying to do. There it is. Come on, girl! Headshot. Why do I feel like I'm getting hit? Oh, I am. Are we done? Come here, Doug. Shit. I thought I saw something up there. I turn this off. What happens? Okay. Ain't nothing. Okay. What is that? Oh my god. Why? Okay. We just had a gunfight, and there's some fool in here saying, I must have had a concussion, I'm seeing things. Jesus Christ. No wonder you people are just living in burnout houses and can't do anything for yourselves. Oh, God. Freaking hate you all. So, ah! Out of body experience. Um, Show your face! Come on! I dare you! Where? The hell? How are you? Can't you see I'm trying to loot your bet, your friends? I'm trying to take all their good shit so then I can come kill you. Uh huh, huh. All right, fuck it. More clothes hanger. Those could potentially help me. Fashionable glasses. Yeah, well. We got time for fashion. Army fatigues, huh? A bathrobe. Pipe rifle automatic. Nope, we're not what we're looking for. I'll take all of your shit though. Well not all of it. Ooh. Yep, that'd be a cool hat. Wait, is that a person's body hanging up? Or a mannequin? Oh, are those mannequins? Oh, it's a trolley! It's a trophy. Hell yeah! It's time to boogie! We got to. Sorry, everybody. If you don't know who the boogie knight is, you need to. You need to. You need to. You know, change your lifestyle, yo. Um. Trophy. Nice. All right. That's very cool. But uh, we definitely need our our friggin' flight helmet. But we'll hold on to that. We'll drop this. And that'll be our hat we wear if we wear a hat. Okay. Let's go! Well, I don't think that's a mannequin. Nope. Alright. Any medicine in the things? Um, right away, yep. Okay. All these damn hair clip pins things. Could probably use some of those. Is that clean water, I wonder? Hmm. Hmm. Doc, I kind of want you to go find the bad guys for me. I know you can kind of do that, you know? Like, I kind of want you to. Not really. Ooh. Take that shit. Oh, I don't know if I needed that, but I took it anyway. Cooking. Take all of your stuff, you bandity bastards. You bandity bastards. This is bullshit. You wanna know what bullshit is? Having to come in here and deal with your punk ass. A bowler? Oh man. Oh man. Jangles the moon monkey. A tube flange. Oh my god, we just hit the jackpot. Definitely not taking the damn elevator. That's just dumb. Blah. Okay. Let's uh let's take the express. Wait. 
feel like they'd be expecting me to come up that way. Where was that? Right here. Okay. Hello? What is that? A fucking cage? What the shit? Oh, you people are fucking weird. Is that a Brahmin skull? Brahmin. They told me what that was. Somebody told me. Somebody, yeah. I'm not out of character knowledge this. No, not at all. Okay. There are people talking. One lady who can't decide whether or not she's just crazy or actually hearing me. And a guy who thinks something's bullshit. Is a radio going? Damn elevator. You know what? I'm probably gonna have to take the elevator up. They got it working. <coughs> oh shit. Yeah. Who the fuck? Stealth. No! You know that? It's called fear. You're hitting a dog with your pistol, you st stupid ass bastard. You know that is called fear. Fucking douche nozzle. God damn it. Um, dog meat. You like that music, huh? It's dancing in the music. Yeah! Get it! <laughs> <laughs> that was fucking weird. Okay. Oh, uh, I don't even need those. I'll take that and that, though. Pipe revolver pistol. There. Done, right? Done, right? Fuck. No, can't. Can't crouch down and do it. It gets dumb. Pipe. Revolver. Pistol. Right? That's That's it right there. They, they, yeah, it's a handmade little thing, right? That's the thing. Fuck, is it not? Oh, God. Ah! Okay. Um, so, no, apparently that was not the right one. We found a pipe revolver pistol, and we're also about at the time limit for this episode, so I kind of feel like Rose, um... Isn't waiting for the pit boy to beep at her and tell her she accomplished her mission. <laughs> She's gonna be like, hey, I found a pipe revolver pistol, here it is. Um, but honestly, I wouldn't know what to do with it next. It's not like we just picked up this quest. If I knew who got it, I'd be like, let's go back and give it to him. Ooh. Oh, shit. What did I just do? Did I walk outside? Oh, under the roof. Oh, God, we're gonna die. Let's go, guns are blazing. Guns are frickin' blazing. Oh <laughs> Thanks, hold him, hold him right there. Nice. <laughs> I was right in that dude's fucking face. And he was like, dude, dude, wait. You're not supposed to bam in the face. Okay. Um. So yeah, I was saying, if I knew who gave me the thing, I would... I would take it... Ooh, nice. I would... If I knew who gave me the quest, I would take the one I just picked up back to him and say, here! Here's your shit! Oh, hey. That's to the outside. Nice. Okay. <coughs> wolf, wolf. Turning invisible and barking at things. I like it. I don't even need those. That and that'll take... I should just pick up all the ammo. Oh shit, dog! Why are you pissing off automated turrets? Are you? Fuck, ah, dog! Why are you doing that? Okay, so I don't even know who to take it back to, and the th the truth is, it's that's just a game mechanic that's wacky. Is that um, I will only know if I find the right one. Um, I'll only know if I find the correct... Jesus, what? How the fuck? Oh my god, get... I'm so pissed off at you right now. Get, get shotgun, mother... I can't believe I didn't notice that thing. I opened the door and everything. I didn't see it right there. Anyway, dog, come back here. Right, do whatever you want. You're your own person. Um... 
so yeah, I, I mean, I don't honestly don't know. Um, I won't, I can't figure out where to take it. Maybe, maybe there's no one to take it to. Maybe it's supposed to be some legendary thing, and it is, and some special weapon. Um, but she found one, and she's like, it's the same shit, what? And then we, we freaking leave. So, I'm gonna call that quest done! Because we found the pipe revolver. Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Right, pipe revolver. Pipe revolver. I mean, it says pistol, but a revolver is a pistol, so that's not really... And she's like, eh, well, yeah, but... Eh, eh. Okay, this is supposed to be awesome. All right, let's roll with that. All right, which means I guess we should be picking up this ammo type right here because it's um, it's, it's what goes in this thing. Okay, well we're gonna end it right here, and um, what I'll do is I'll say right now I'll say that we accomplished the quest. I'll take it off, and it works because it's the end of the episode, and that's fine. But um, we'll leave it available if we roll for it next time. And if we do that, the roleplay will be that she was looking at this going, this can't be the thing. I'm going to go look a little more, uh, and we'll go back in and see what happens. So, anyway, that's what we'll do. Thank you all so very much for watching, and until next time. Goodbye, universe.